Greetings from the Eccentric Man. And today I've got a little review of figures. Not these ones though. These are 6mm, which we bought for our Napoleonic project. Uh, painted them up. And as you know from the previous videos, I'm looking at 10mm American Civil War. And eagle-eyed viewers, in the video of the showcase of the Confederates and the Union, may have spotted in the background, on the table map, uh, some of these buildings. But I thought, well, they are too small. I'm not going to get away with it. So what I've done is I've sent off for some 10 mil buildings. And that's what we're going to have a look at. So here are the buildings, and these are from Battlescale War Games Buildings at battlescale.com. I saw them on Twitter, and he's also building up his own ACW 10 mil army. Let's start off with the bridge then. So these are resin, 10 mil buildings. And I hope you can see the detail on it. You can get one which has cobblestones down it, but that's the casting of it. Very nice size. What's even better is that I've measured it and my 30 mil bases for the American Civil War figures fits across the bridge. Now that was just pure luck, but uh, I'm really pleased with that. So I can have stands crossing the bridge uh, which is really good. So that's the bridge. So uh, yeah, very nice. In fact, I'll uh, I'll do a picture of a stand on it, so you can have a look at that. Next up, <laughs> some um, hay sacks. There we go. Uh, here they are. And I've got paint on my nails. This, the casting is really nice. There are no air bubbles in any of the casting on these miniatures. So I've got four of those to, uh, to put in the fields for uh, me rural farm. So yeah. Hey. It's going to cause me a little bit of trouble because I haven't got a river on my battle mat. So I'm going to have to uh, look at how I make that. But I couldn't resist this water mill. Uh, comes in two bits. But really nice. Couldn't resist it. And again, the quality of the casting is really nice. I mean, obviously that's on the inside, so you're not going to see that bit, but uh, other bits. Really nice. And on the building, you've got your wood planks going across it, you've got your stonework, your tiles. Look at that. Oh, I, am, <laughs> I am really impressed with these. Excellent. The water mill. Very nice. Small cabin, anyone? I think just uh, not too many needed for the board because I'm not doing a town battle, but on a six by four table or even by a four by four table, a smattering of uh, little buildings across is, uh, is good. What I was thinking of, I was actually thinking of doing a, a little scenic base for these so just to make it a little bit more uh, dynamic when it sits on the the table but lovely detail i think very nice going up in the housing market well okay let's have a look at a farmhouse with an attached barn that's me sh shaking it's not the table Yeah. 
very interesting, getting a bit of paint on these. So, yeah, very nice. Finally, the uh, Grand Mansion. Well, sort of Grand Mansion anyway. Uh, so, yeah, again, good casting, crisp casting in the resin. So I would give a thumbs up to Battle Scale War Games Buildings. They are really nice. You can find them on Twitter at battlescale.com. And you can find them on the internet at battlescale.com as well. Really nice. They do 6mm, 10mm, starting to do a little bit of 20mm, and some bits and pieces of 28mm, but... Uh, 28mm seems to be like battle hexes, terrain hexes. So, yeah, if you're looking for buildings for your 10mm, these are really nice. Price wise, I think the most expensive of these was about a fiver. So, yeah, I think all, all told it comes to about 30 quid, including 32 quid, including postage for all the buildings and the hay, haystacks and postage. But once painted up and on the table, I think they're going to be really nice. So I'll finish off with a picture of the troops on the bridge and we'll go with that. Well, how about that for a fit? That is excellent and that is uh, so lucky to have that fit as it does. Anyway, those are the troops on the bridge. Well, I hope you enjoyed watching the uh, little review. As I say, these are really nice, really nice buildings. Uh, I've just put a, a still picture of all of them as well, so you can uh, have another little browse as it's running through. So, Battlescale War Games Buildings at battlescale.com. Really nice. Hope you enjoyed it. Give a thumbs up if you did. Uh, comment below and subscribe if you haven't. Until the next time, I'll leave you with Infamy Infamy coming very soon. Going to pre-order either this Friday or early next week. So keep your eyes out for Infamy Infamy on the old interwebs. Take care, see you soon.